Hi, internet people. Real quick, so the lighting is not the best, but I was just in the kitchen trying to get stuff done. Uh, I was trying to clean. I had to mop the floors. So my four-year-old, who was running all over the place, I had to contain him somewhere. He wasn't pleased. He wanted something to eat. And he started making a mess. And I had just mopped the floors. <laughs> and I found myself getting upset, you know? And then I realized, you know what? I can mop the floor again, or I could just clean in that one area that he messed up. But we are on top of each other every single day um, with this lockdown, right? A lot of us are home with our families for extended periods of time, longer than we're used to spending with them. And as moms, especially, sometimes it can get to be a bit much. Um, so I just walked away, you know, I just walked away for a minute and I came to my room and just took some breaths and I came back, but I just wanted to stop and talk to you guys and remind you all the stuff I talked about in my last video, self-care, um, you know, taking that time for yourself, being mindful about what you're doing, being mindful about what you're consuming, trying to educate yourself. Um, these are things that are going to help. I could have yelled at him, right? And I'm not saying this to pat myself on the back because I have yelled at him, probably yelled at him earlier. Um, but these are the things that help us to stop from snapping, right? So whatever it is that you need to do to take care of yourself so that you can take care of your family, I just want to remind you to do that, especially with this upcoming Mother's Day. Motherhood may seem like <laughs> such a drag sometimes, but our children are so precious and we are training up the next generation. So we really have to be careful about um, how we interact with them try to do it with grace and with gentleness and with love and try to treat yourself with grace with gentleness and with love stay well blessings